All right, my friends, so today we are doing just a quick little video for you, and it's for those of you that are on a Mac, and you're like, how do I do like screen recording, and how do I do screen capturing, and take little clips of stuff, and I figured I'd show you that. Yeah, so we have my MacBook right here, <clears throat> and we can do a few things. We can just, we'll bring up like, uh, we'll bring up this, which is just a Google window. Okay, we'll make that a little smaller. We'll bring up, uh, I don't know, we'll bring up Apple News, just, just something, right? And really the shortcuts for these, uh, it's all done with the command key, the shift key, and then you have a three, four, or a five, okay? So you're gonna go like command shift three, and you'll hear that little camera click. And command shift three does everything. So everything on the screen, and you would have seen it kind of pop up on the bottom here, but if we move this over under screenshots, you'll see that we got everything. Now, I seem to screenshot uh, my other monitor, is what it seemed to screenshot. Maybe it was based on whatever where my mouse was. Now, now, I'm, now I'm curious, if my mouse is here, screenshot, yeah. So depending on where your mouse is, I'm, I'm learning too, right? Depending on where your mouse is, you'll see now we have, there we go, right? This is our screenshot. Very good. Cool. So that is uh, Command Shift and the number three key. Then you have Command Shift four. And Command Shift four, you'll see on the screen, it turns into like a little target, which allows you to be like, oh, I just want this graphic. So I'm going to just go up to the top corner and select this. And you just get that little piece. So that little piece comes up. And again, it'll save to your screenshots. So that'll just pop up. And now you get a little screenshot of that section, which is cool. So that's Command Shift 4. But there's a trick with Command Shift 4, which I kind of like. And I'm going to use this back window here, this guy here. And you'll see that I've got a window covering this window. So Command Shift 4, if you hit your space bar as soon as you do it, you'll see a little camera come up. Now this highlights or this highlights or this highlights. And what it's doing is it's gonna capture a, a window. And that window can literally be a window behind another window. So for instance, if I went here, even though this is covered, right, by this window, if I click on that, you'll actually see that it got all of it. It's like magic, it's like weird voodoo magic. Last but not least, and it's actually something that I'm using right now, and you'll see a little little record button in the corner, is if you hit Command Shift 5, um, this at the bottom allows you to do kind of all of your uh, capturings, capturing features, Command Shift 5. And that's probably the one that I use the most unless I need something just quick. So you can do a capture entire screen, you can do capture selected window, you can do capture selected portion, Right, or you can do screen recording. And right now, mine says stop recording because I'm currently recording. And if you go into the options, this is really big for the screen recording. You can uh, tell it, like if you have different uh, mic sources or something like that, and you can tell it which microphone to use, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, and then you have a capture button. And then if you decide that you didn't want to do any of this, you just kind of hit your escape button and it kicks out. Now, for me as well, since I have dual displays, the moment that you do a screen capture, so you're doing a recording of it, uh, it'll come up and ask first off which display you'd like to use. And what happens is the displays light up. So you'll go to display one and it'll that one will lighten up, the other one will darken. So you kind of get a visual as to which display it's talking about. And then you just let it go. And when you're finished, there's a little little plus or little little record guy up at the very top here. You just tap it, stops the recording, and uh, you're good to go. There it is. Screen recording on the Mac. Screen recording, screen capturing, image capturing, getting all that goodness. Yeah, useful. All right, guys. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe. More Mac tips on Tuesdays. We try to do them on Tuesdays if we can. And uh, that's it. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Later.